your thoughts on Dealer Socket Notification Center? Yeah, the Notification Center has been very nice for me personally. It lets me keep track of my uh, sales managers and my salespeople um, and also my own work plan. Uh, so I've got some of my own internal customers that are you know, friends of the family, friends of the dealership that I deal with one-on-one. -on -one. So I kind of see it from all angles. And the notification center is very handy to make sure I don't miss an email that in past, you know, in the past could get buried in, in my to-dos and I, I would have a chance of missing because it's outside of my Outlook email. So it's it's been very helpful that way. Okay, great. And then um, if you can kind of tell me about how our mobile application, uh, mobile CRM, has kind of helped you and helped your team, that sort of thing. Sure. Well, my salespeople have really benefited from the, the mobile app, and they've all downloaded it. All of my salespeople have smartphones now, really specifically for that resource. That's what kind of got us to that point. And uh, it's very handy if you're, you're out either at the dealership, you're on the lot, you're out in the, the community and you want to store some information or update some notes, you can now do it from your smartphone and, and a lot of our salespeople have really embraced that, which has come in handy. And then the other thing is it, it also, we don't necessarily have every contact of every customer in our contacts on our cell phone, but we have access to that through the app. So again, if you're, maybe it's a, a day off or you just you know, want to follow up with a customer quick, if you're not in front of a computer or you're at the store, you can still get that information on the mobile app, which comes in really handy to just access quick some notes from a customer or, as importantly, you know, uh, phone number or email for that customer. So, okay, great. And um, uh, if you can tell me how you utilize Dealer Socket in managing your sales team, um, and if you know if you incorporate it in any meetings or that that sort of thing. Sure, there, there's probably two main ways we do that. The first way is through the daily checkout reports we use with the salespeople. Every sales manager at the beginning and end of the day will track what they did yesterday, namely completed phone calls and appointments set and showed. And they'll do that at the beginning and end of the day. So that's the interaction with the sales manager and salesperson and the salespeople know what they're accountable for that way. And the other way is every morning in our uh, five days a week, every morning we have a save a deal meeting that the managers are part of. Um, and we'll look at the desking log that way to see you know what was the activity yesterday and then as a group how many outbound calls were made how many appointments are set for today so we know if we have 10 appointments set today you know five might show we might sell two or three cars so we kind of know maybe you know how many car deals we have in our back pocket before the day starts so that's been really beneficial okay great um, and then anything else that you would like to add as far as uh, maybe something that we didn't talk about but you think that Dealer Socket has really helped you um, be successful. Sure. Well, I, I would just say that the um, the support uh, for our rep coming in is is very beneficial versus you know some other vendors out there. Um, our rep Ryan is in uh, you know every three or four weeks. He's around. He wants to know what's going on and be part of it and and really bring some you know help us raise our game as we go. We've sort of got the basics now and and to run things like list builders and campaigns and, and some of the more advanced techniques. He's really helped us with that. So the face-to-face the, the -face has been very helpful too. So. Okay, great. Well, thank you so much for your time.